it, hopefully get there in about uh, 30 minutes. That would be amazing. And I also think that it, not only would it help me, but it would encourage other students who know that they just can't afford it. Uh, other people, other young adults would be more willing to get into school because it wouldn't be so far out of reach. Um, I still am paying back student loans from a previous school that I was going to, a trade. And, um, you know, that on top of this, just trying to get my education and trying to better myself over the time, it costs a lot of money. Yeah, it'd be really great for student veterans because we have to take our classes and use our GI Bill and that money goes towards our bills, but it would be nice, uh, you know, if it passes and we get to go to community college for free because we could save that money and use it towards a four-year university, if not pursue a master's degree and have a little bit of chance to further our education. Hi there. How you doing? This proposal does a couple of things that I think is, is really important. One, it recognizes that we've got to get more people in the door. But it also uh, has built into the model uh, the encouragement for students to complete. Students must have at least a 2.5 grade point average. They also need to be enrolled either full-time or half-time because we know that students who start out that aren't at least looking at a half-time enrollment are very unlikely to complete the degree and move forward. So it's a very good model. that states have uh, been divesting in, uh, in higher education. If you look across the country, uh, we've seen tuition rates go up while state investment in higher education going down. Uh, an important part of this model is that while the federal government would put in three quarters of the cost of tuition, that means at least one quarter will need to come from the states to support to make that happen. They still worry about it because we may be inexpensive at $59 a credit hour, but if you don't have the $59, it really uh, it, it d doesn't matter. So they talked to us about that. They also expressed concerns about uh, transportation, uh, access to uh, our campuses, which is why we're seeing online courses grow as well. And as we understand the model, uh, that uh, online courses would also be, be covered under the uh, pr president's proposal. These two are full. There's still some available. Uh, this one's only for students. I need some more wine. Here's 1403. That one. I mean, you think, yeah, 1403. Yeah. Okay. Pick those. 